Big Braids and Crypto. I'm your host, Mr. Big Braids, coming to you live from reservation somewhere. Take a look at AVT, REQ, and Suku to complete the night. Well, let's get it started. Take a look at AVT. AVT is coming at 228. Definitely got my eye on this. Could possibly be setting up for a bearish butterfly scenario. This scenario could be playing out, uh, but with BTC, you know, basically sitting at 44. Uh, definitely could be seen, you know, setting up for this scenario here. Definitely excited to see where we're going as far as AVT. Uh, so, uh, as far as AVT, we definitely got to keep an eye on the support at uh, 618 at 198. If we do come back down and retest that support at the one, at 198, if we lose that support, uh, definitely could see some consolidation down to the 786 at 143. And if we lose that support, at 143, you know, could possibly be wishful thinking. Uh, definitely been looks like it's been holding for quite some time. Uh, above the 618 and, and above the 786, I'm definitely excited to see where we're going as far as uh, AVT. Uh, as far as making moves to the upside, we're definitely going to make our way up to this 274, grab some support and consolidation. And as far as uh, getting some bullish moves up to the upside, we're definitely going to get over this 399, grab some support and consolidation, start making our next moves up. So uh, keep an eye on that price action as far as AVT and keep an eye on that support at the 618 at 198. Uh, you know, are we going to get that price action? You know, it just remains to be seen. Uh, we'll do a follow-up video tomorrow and see where we're at. But definitely excited to see BTC up over 44,000. And, uh, you know, definitely excited to see some which coins are going to start moving around once we start making those moves to the upside. Uh, so moving on up to REQ. REQ is coming in at 0.2311. Let me get zoomed out long-term picture here. Uh, see if we can get a better look on the situation here. Yeah, I had a lot of consolidation over, uh, you know, the year to date here. Let's go ahead and go out to the year to date here. Uh, tons of consolidation, uh, you know, came, came in just at, a, you know, above $1.20, which was some major moves to the upside. Uh, sitting here at 23 cents. Uh, you know, that'd be some amazing price action. I'm definitely keeping an eye on that support at 0 0.1990. So if we do lose that support, uh, definitely going to start seeing some lower price action on REQ. Uh, with BTC sitting up over 44000 you know, definitely excited to see if, uh, you know, REQ is going to start making some moves to the upside. Already up, you know, close to 2%. Uh, as far as making smooth to the upside and getting some decent recovery, we got to make our way up to the 786 at 0.4134, grab some support and consolidation, start making our moves up to the upside. Uh, and as far as, the, you know, beginning a bullish scenario and, uh, <coughs> oh, excuse me, and making smooth to the upside, uh, we definitely get over the 618 at 0.5817, grab some support and consolidation, start making our moves up to the upside. You know, extremely bullish scenario, making moves to the upside. Uh, we got to get over this 120, uh, grab some support consolidation, start making some moves to the upside. So that would be the extremely bullish scenario, moves to the upside. Uh, definitely excited to see where we're going as far as REQ uh, coming in at 23 cents. Uh, I'm definitely still out here lurking for some lower price action. Am I going to get it? You know, it just remains to be seen. But, you know, with BTC sitting up at 44,000, possibly making some moves to the upside, you know, that could be just wishful thinking. But, you know, the market could change daily. We got a lot of stuff going on overseas. You know, we get the wrong news going and, you know, could possibly see some lower price action. So keep an eye on that news and keep an eye on that price action. Uh, you know, definitely helping crypto, you know, as far as, you know, getting the word out and, uh, you know, getting that adaptability, you know, sounds like it's helping in the efforts uh, with, uh, you know, all this conflict that's going on. So, you know, definitely getting the best advertisement that we can as far as, uh, you know, the market and crypto. Uh, so, you know, could be definitely looking up for a lot of good projects out here, uh, but that just remains to be seen. You know, it could definitely affect the market in a negative way as well. So we definitely got to keep an eye on that price action keep an eye on that news uh so you know as far as req uh keep an eye on that support at uh, 0 0.1990 and uh you know we'll do some follow-up videos tomorrow and see where we're at so moving on up to suku suku's coming in at 0 2487. I uh, definitely had a, a lot of consolidation as well. Definitely all those sales price targets that we were hitting uh, have definitely been hit, uh, except for that 0 0.0935. Still was lurking around for it, you know, with BTC sitting up at 44,000. You know, could possibly be wishful, wishful thinking, but you know, just like we were saying just 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 now, definitely could possibly see some lower price action, you know, at a moment's notice. So uh, a lot of fear and the fear index is still kind of high. So, uh, but as far as getting some making some moves to the upside, we definitely got to get our way up to this uh, 0.3227, uh, excuse me, 0.3227, grab some support consolidation, make our way up to the 786 at 0.4020. And, uh, you know, that would be some decent recovery moves to the upside. As far as getting the bullish scenario, we definitely got to get back up to over the 618 at 0.4643, uh, grab some support consolidation. 
and make our way up to this uh, 0 0.5518. Grab some support and consolidation as far as, uh, you know, getting getting the extremely bullish scenario and moves, moves the upside. We get over this 0.6935 and uh, start working on our next leg up. So keep an eye on that price set. You know, I'm still out here looking for that lower price action, that 0 0.09, sub 0 0.09. You know, am I going to get it? Could possibly be some wishful thinking, but, uh, you know, <laughs> definitely out here uh, working like a shark. So uh, keep an eye on that price action on Suku. We'll do a follow-up video tomorrow and see where we're at. So everybody in the coins we talked about tonight, good luck. And you always got to remember this is not financial advice. These are my views and opinions views and opinions on the market only and you always got to do what's right for you so you always have a good afternoon good evening good morning good night mr big braids is signing out